मॉडल फॉर्म एज वेल ग्लाइड मॉडल फॉर्म सो दिस ग्लाइड मॉडल फॉर्म व्हाट इट डज आई एक्चुअली शो यू गाइस okay so this is actually glide dialog window this is actually glide di uh, glide model this is glide model form glide model form guys so here i am actually using create incident okay here i am actually passing table name here i am passing table name okay so here this one i am not passing anything i am passing empty i don't need even this such string parameter as well so what it does you guys you guys can see what it does you guys can clearly see it will open the incident form it will open the incident form see it has opened the incident form or not did you guys notice that did you guys notice that or not yes it has directly opened the incident form let us say here if you want to as soon as you open the case form as well as, as, as along with that uh, case form if you want to open the problem form as well so what you will do in this client script in place of this incident you will actually keep uh, here in the table name you will keep problem okay is that clear now if i open this one it will first open the case form so after loading the case form it is it, it it has opened the problem form or not you guys can clearly notice here so it has opened the problem form or not hmm is this a problem form or not guys tell me is problem so that is how you will actually uh, call the another table form over here okay so if you guys have noticed one thing if you guys have noticed one thing we have created a ui action called create incident did you guys remember did you guys remember that yes hmm that create incident record will only appear on existing records that create incident record uh, create incident uh, ui action will only appear on existing records now i am just uh, so this is the create incident right so as soon as i click on this create incident as soon as i click on this create incident button it has to open incident form rather than creating directly on the table and showing the number here what what should happen when i click on this button the page, the, the the incident form should appear the incident form should appear then what i will do i will take this script out so let me just keep here as incident i'll take this script out 
what i do i'll go to the ui action right click configure ui action so this ui action is actually a server side ui action right this ui action is a server side ui action right so then what i will do i will make this client callable okay now what will happen so let me just create a record here let me just deactivate this this client script i'm just uh, saving this one now the ui action will appear so once i click on this one right it it will open the incident form so it did not directly create a record right it did not directly create a record right so it has opened the incident form from this incident form you will actually submit all these things okay you can submit an incident here okay so that that incident number also you can you can get it you can you can populate it here as well okay so here for that we we might have to use glide ajax again so we might have to use glide ajax again so okay just for now you can understand that you can call the incident form directly using this glide model form okay just remember you guys have to use glide model form to call the any table form on the another table is that clear right that is clear right everyone